The river of research continues on cannabis and endometriosis. Today we have this survey and a review. This was a survey of over 900 people with endometriosis in German-speaking countries here in Europe. The numbers were pretty incredible. For those using cannabis, and I quote, cannabis was rated as the most effective self-management strategy to reduce symptom intensity. Additionally, 90% of the participants were able to decrease their pain medication intake. The greatest improvement was observed in sleep, 91%, menstrual pain, 90%, and non-cyclic pain, 80%. Apart from increased fatigue, 17%, side effects were infrequent. Also remember, at the time this survey was done in Germany, Austria, and Switzerland, cannabis was illegal, but people kept using it because it worked. If you want more proof, here's a new review that covered eight different articles, four of them being surveys, two systematic reviews, one retrospective cohort study, and one literature review. They summarize, cannabis consumption for symptom relief was common on women with endometriosis and some even reported less use of painkillers.